Hi everyone, it's Rachel Hockenberry here, and today I want to talk with you a little bit about right hand position in horn playing. I know that was one of the most confusing things to me when I started playing horn, was what on earth do I do with this thing? <laughs> now before we get started, I want to clarify that I'm showing you my personal hand position. Every person's hand position is going to be a little bit different because everybody's hand is different different shapes and different sizes. So I'm going to show you what I do and hopefully you can use that as a guide for what you do. First, let's just talk about what the hand actually looks like inside of the bell. To start, you want to hold your hand like you're cupping a puddle of water in the palm of your hand and you don't want to let any of it fall out. So as you'll see, I've created a seal between all of my fingers. My fingers are straight and if you were actually holding water in here, none of it would slip out, right? My thumb is actually tucked a little bit behind my index finger to create a really nice seal. So you're cupping this water in your hands, none of it will slip out through any cracks. Then, you wanna take that position and put it alongside of the bell. The most common mistake that young horn players make is to just palm the bell with the side of their hand. That does not help horn playing in any way. <laughs> so we want to actually take this hand position and put it on the other side of the bell so that it's actually the back of the hand that's making contact with the bell. You want to put it at approximately 2 o'clock inside of the bell. Now again, everyone will be a little bit different. Some people will be shifted up or down slightly. Some people will have their hand a little further in or out. If you have a larger hand, you're going to want the hand to be out a little bit further because you want to make sure you don't clog the sound. For me, my hand goes in far enough so that the bottom knuckle of my thumb is making contact with the bell. A lot of horn players actually end up with calluses on that part of their thumb because that's the part that's actually supporting the instrument when you play off the leg. So this is what my hand position looks like and hopefully it's a good approximation for you so you know how to get started. Thanks and I'll talk with you soon.